In this video, you are going to learn how to set up CookieBot template in your website using Google Tag Manager. Hi, this is Nasim from nasimrezer.com and I am a top rated freelancer on Upwork. If you need my assist, don't forget to check this video description because I will give all the resource link out there. Let's back to this topic. As you can see, this is CookieBot official website. If you search on Google CookieBot or directly input the link which is cookiebot.com then you will get this interface and first of all you can check their pricing because it is not free you can see this is one free plan and one premium and one premium medium and premium large so you can use their premium in 40 day free trial but for this case I will not use their premium package because if I show you their all the features they offer with free or premium you can see this is the huge benefit so of course you need to check and you need to understand about your business model so which one you should use you can simply use and choose and you can see this is my website which is very simple so i have one domain that i want to set up cookiebot and i think this free plan is enough for me so that's why i am opening my account on the free plan okay you can see first of all we need to create account for this case i just continue with google account you can see I'm selecting my Google account and then continue and it's opening my website account so you can see in cookie board I have completed open my account okay so my account is opening on the cookie board so if you use the manual then you need to set up password etc so maybe it can be different let's check it here you can see i am using consulting as a industry operator in and company in the role of their owner so i want to use business owner of course you always you should choose the appropriate with yours and just simply next and you can see i just uh, where you are looking to achieve the cookie bot cm so i just want to collect constant for advertising purpose i just want to select that and how you learn cookie word i just uh, want to so you can choose anyone but i just want to search google and being etc select it it's just an survey so you don't need to worry about that and then get started and now you can see we need to add our domain here so for this case my domain name is nasimreza.com but i want to copy and paste here and then next and you can see here is the wise gdpr you want to use of course you should use based on your business area for this video i just want to choose only europe but you can change it anytime don't worry about that so next and you can see how it's actually the configure of banner so how you want to set your banner and how it will be look like in your website you can see this is a preview always i like bar mode and you can use dialog mode also i think bar mode is pretty good for me and always i use this board bottom and mixed outline so you can see i just use solid of the bottom all the bottom okay and if you want you can use your logo for this case i just want to use my picture as a logo you can see so it's previewing here so that's mean if you select your logo you can see the live preview and now you can see uh, here is the eu only i just want to you pick all visitor right now because 
I have uh, like you know I my website is not only for euro okay Europe okay so you can see uh, I just want to keep it the button all and now it's pretty good and then next and when you click on next then you can see this is the implementation this is the last step of the cookie bot so you can see here is the manual google tag manager and wordpress so if i sh of course we are going to use google tag manager because this is the a great way and our website is already connected with google tag manager and you can see they are guiding you how you can set up through google tag manager just simply read and do with your website so i think you will know about that so first of all we need to add the template so and we need to add only this code if we use google tag manager okay so let's copy this simple code from here and open google tag manager website so if your website is already connected with google tag manager and if you don't know then you can use this extension then this ext it's a google tag assistant legacy extension it say uh, your website will connected with google tag manager or not so my website is connected with google tag manager i know and i'm pretty sure about that and you can see this is the container that are connected and if your website is not connected just simply open google tag manager container and copy and paste this code and then your website will be connected with google tag manager it's pretty simple i hope you can do that and when you have done now it's time to set up tag and you can see our website already have few tag for cookie constant we just need to open a new tag so you can see what they say they are talking about just add a new templates which is cookie bot so go to community template gallery and then search the cookie bot you can see it's loading and this is the search icon just search cookie bot and uh, you can see this is the cookie bot cmp and just simply add to workspace so add it and when it's added just copy that cookie bot id in here so go back the cookie constant account and copy the cookie bot id so you can see if i paste it oh sorry it's a google tag manager account just remove it and go back again on the cookie bot account and simply copy this code uh, like it's under the quotation mark just you need to careful about that okay when it's done then hit the trigger and trigger we need to use constant installation all pages just select it and then save it and i just want to keep this exact same name that they are offering so just save hit the save button so it's done now we need to submit or preview so always i recommend to preview first after submitting any version so you can see our work almost done we need to check it and you can see the cookie bot is here also uh, it's only showing this template but we need to do another small setting so for setting that you can see there is no cookie bot coming here so for this way just simply go to admin and then select a menu from here the right side which is container setting and you can see the additional constant setting is here just enable it and save it so when your container has said then if you go on the tag manager 
you can see another a brand new checkmark box is here so we just simply select all the third party tags from here and we need to save that so if i i just want don't need to uh, get started it just select all so if you want you can do one by one you can see there is no the rules are showing here like add storage add personalization etc so simply select just i just want to uh, set up it for all the tag that i already built and then you can see no additional constant required just select so that's mean you will use their default one and then you can see the built-in constant is now set up with all the tag that we our previous tab and you can see constant setting is now show all the default tag and now it's time to go on the preview again and check out our constant so if i go here there and you can see our cocky bot is here and you can see it's uh, now fired but if uh, i allow all and get back the cookie constant and now you can see this is now all granted so that means it is working from now so this is the quick video and it's required uh, some technical modification i think uh, this enough for you to set up a cookie board and if you need further help you can contact me and when you have done you just need to publish this version then it will start working from now so that's it i hope uh, you can understand everything so if you don't understand any part you can copy it and you can comment down of this video that's all for today if you found this video was useful then hit the thumbs up and if you want to see more video from me then consider subscribing to this channel because it will help me to continue working on this channel my name is nasim and i will see you on the next video till then bye have a good day